My name is Sheila Halo and I'm from Billings, Montana. And I came here to work with Chad Andrews for like 10, 10 days, but I ended up staying for an extra two. Yeah. Because yeah. I got pretty busy cranking out prints, so. What do you think of the place? I love it. I love it. I showed up and I didn't really know what to expect. Chad didn't really explain to me that he had this whole community around him. And I've been really impressed just with camaraderie and uh, people just getting stuff done and who really care about it. You know, at this point, Chad, he's, I haven't seen him. I hadn't seen him in years when I decided to come and still like jumped at the opportunity to come visit him. And, you know, he's become like one of my best friends in the past 10 days. And, um, you know, everyone I've met here has been a joy to talk to, work with. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it's an inspiring kind of energy. I, yeah. hate, I don't do that, throw that word around lightly, but you know, it's, I can sincerely say that. So when it's appropriate, right? Yeah. yeah. So talk about your work a little bit. What you are, what kind of work? You... Um, somewhere between drawing and painting. So that makes printmaking really fun. I haven't done it in, in years, but I got to come use Chad's presses. <laughs> I get accused of being cerebral at times, which sometimes I'll take it as a compliment. Sometimes I wish that I understood more about the way I work, but um, I guess I like to start confused and then end up clear on my ideas. Mm -hmm. and That's kind of the impression I had of your work. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, seeing it in process, I don't get it until I've seen it finished. Piece. Yeah, yeah, I don't get it's it. It's so either. different. An artist, I hate artist statements, and they're always theoretical, you know. Yeah. So, yeah, I guess, um, I don't try to force any ideas or anything upon people. I don't try to send out clear messages. It's more, you know, random signs, symbols, reactions I have to the world around me kind of scraped off the surface and thrown into images and, mm -hmm. um, no, it's, it's like concepts and stuff are not really that important to me uh, as far as subject matter goes, just the experience of looking at something. Mm -hmm. So I, I have facility to, to draw draw whatever I want, essentially, but I'm not interested in that. I like to investigate sort of how that can int uh, sort of bounce off of painting and more expl exploration, exploratory yeah. mark making, that kind of who, thing. Who inspires you? Art-wise. Art-wise? Well, uh, um. <laughs> or, God, you know, anybody who, anybody who throws you? down hard, you know? There's yeah. a lot of, uh, well, there's this guy over here, of course. Um, there, I'll clip that out. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, I come from Montana, so there's Western art everywhere. And that's, mm -hmm. I don't... It it's not. It doesn't. Or... It doesn't repel me. It doesn't inspire me. It inspires me if they take it seriously. And mm -hmm. it's it, Montana is a world of like art gimmicks. People, there's a lot of rich people who paint the same shit over and over and over again. Um, can I swear? I don't of course know. you can. <laughs> uh, yeah, just people who are genuine about what they do and. Mm -hmm. um, it's gonna sound cha uh, cheesy, but people who are interested in what other people are doing as well. Some, some artists get selfish and self-centered. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, like that etching uh, that I might get ready for a show soon. It's, um, I started it in, it's like five years ago. So that's, I got a little bit into it, but print making is a whole ball of wax that kind of has well, you do kind of need a big press. And there's no yeah, you need, all this whole plethora of different materials and yeah, it's uh, same with me. I mean, I I loved prints, but I had never had any kind of access to a print uh, a, a press. You know, I never. You know, yeah. it's just I wasn't uh, so interested that I would go and take a class somewhere or go off to school and study it. But here, I can just walk down the hall. Which is yeah. amazing. Yeah, amazing, it's great. You know, and I've seen people come in just who heard about it and wanted to check it out, and just people showing interest. And it's yeah. really cool. Yeah. So. Wait, what was what was the? What it, what's your impression of the Williamsport art scene? 
question from the local gallery owner. It's like watching a movie. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, it's pretty legit. I like it. There's um, I say the movie thing because it's it has every <laughs> you know every component to sort of facilitate an interesting story about art. Mm -hmm. All the key people, you know, and the conflicts, you know, it's like, it's not like some fairy tale wonderland, but mm -hmm. there's, there's stuff getting done, people care about it, it's really cool.